congratulations on the movie. Thank I you. absolutely really, really enjoyed it. Um, what is it about video game movies, do you think, that previously a lot of them haven't s stuck the landing, they haven't been very good, mm. but you think you may have fixed with, with Tomb Raider? I think it's important in any movies, but especially in if it's a video game adaption or if it's any kind of action adventure movie, that you really care about the characters that's, mm -hmm. that you put through all this stuff. And we worked hard to really get the audience invested in Lara as a character. And who came first for, for the project? Was it yourself or was it Alicia? Who, who signed on first? Uh, I signed on first. So when, when Alicia came in to, to audition, I guess, what was it about her that you were like, yes, she is absolutely the Lara Croft that I have in mind? Well, when we started discussing uh, who could play Lara Croft, then immediately Alicia was on the top of our list. Oh, so really? we went to her and said, do you want to play Lara? And, and what, what was it about her previous work? Like, which film of hers were you like, oh, the, that got your attention? Well, be, I'm being, being a Scandinavian filmmaker. I've watched Alicia's movies for years, from her Swedish and Danish work, uh, and then, of course, to the, like, the Ex Machina and the Danish Girl. Yeah. Uh, I've always been a big fan of her. Um, and I understand she got very involved with the stunt work yeah. uh, in this movie. So when she was, when you knew she was throwing herself into all the stunts, did that make you want to make the stunts even more spectacular? Or were you like careful that she was <laughs> going to throw herself a bit too much into it? No, but I think the attitude in this movie was always to make it as authentic as possible and really m make it an immersive experience for the audience, mm -hmm. make you feel like you're in, right in the middle of it with Lara. Yeah. So it was important that Alicia was like in the middle of all this action. Absolutely. So, and she was really up for that. She did a lot of that, those stunts herself and worked really hard with the trainers and the stunt uh, people to really make it uh, spectacular, but also, of course, in a safe way. Yeah. And when you were, when you were, when you seen the script and when you were talking about all the set pieces, was there one particular scene or sequence that you yourself are very excited about you're like what i'm looking forward to filming that one yeah i think both the shipwreck sequence yeah. that we have and also the scene where lara's going down the river into the, into the japanese plane. bomber yeah. and then uh, into the parachute th th those were like some of the key set pieces that was really exciting and were there because the, the plane one reminded me a little bit of um a sequence from the lost world where the, the hanging over the side yeah. of the cliff reminded me a bit of like Spielberg. Yeah. Were there any particular action directors and their work you like that you're kind of referencing or maybe? No, but I, I think I grew up in the eighties in Norway, <laughs> going to the cinema and like watching Spielberg's movies and watching the Raiders of the Lost Ark and the Indiana, Indiana Jones movies, loving those movies. So they've obviously influenced me as a filmmaker as well. And how difficult was it to? put your own stamp on a movie that is so, like, people have loved Tomb Raider for decades now, and there's, there's been mm. huge set pieces that pe people are looking forward to. Like, was it easy for you to make this movie your own, or was it difficult to overcome maybe what other people thought the film should be? No, I think you have to, as a filmmaker, just put all that aside Forget and just, it. yeah. No, and just focus on, like, how do I see this movie? How do I want to make a Tomb Raider movie? And I felt I was giving really free reigns on what kind of movie I wanted to make and and choosing the kind of set pieces we wanted to do. And it was a real collaborative uh, effort, I think, by everybody on this movie. I think I know where my dad went. That's right in the middle of the Devil's Sea. It will be an adventure. Death is not an adventure. 